Oh my gosh, you guys, we're back again. I wasn't ready. Hey, this one is going to be a fun one. I'm talking really fun because we're going to draw emotions. You know what emotions are? Emotions are when you are feeling a certain way and your face shows what you're feeling. Kind of like this. What am I feeling like right now? Who said happy? That's right, I'm sad. That's right, I'm sad. Hey, what emotion does Tex have right now? Huh? That's right, Tex is happy. Okay, now, what about this one? What's this emotion right here? What was that? That's scared, huh? I was scared out of my mind. Ah! Okay. What about this one? Who said angry? That's right. Okay. See, we can make lots of noise, and then when we see this, that to be quiet, right? Okay. Hmm. Is there any others that we could do? How about this one? <sighs> That's right. I'm tired. Okay, so you guys know what emotions are. Now we get to draw them. Okay? So Teachers, you can pause the video if we're not ready, but if we have our pencils and paper in hand, we'll keep going. Okay, remember, if we see Tex, there he is. We're supposed to be quiet. Okay, guys, I want you to take your pencils, and we're going to draw three more oval shapes, just like this. So get them drawn on your paper. And then we'll pause the video until everybody's ready. Okay, all eyes up here. And watch me draw. I'm going to turn each of these ovals into a head. It doesn't matter if they're a boy or a girl. But you need to watch up here because I'm going to have you do this too. Okay? Now this first head, I want this little boy to be looking to the left. So I'm going to put his eyeball on the left side of his eye. And now he's looking left. The next head, I'm going to make another head here. And I want this one to be looking up. Okay, so when you see the eye, eyeballs going in there, or the eyes, think about where you would put the eyeball to make him looking up. Let's see, where would we put it? Right there. Now he's looking up. Okay, on this last one, we're going to make another little head. And you're not drawing yet, right? You're just watching me. We draw the eyes in there. He needs a nose and mouth. I want this one looking down. So I'm not going to do it right now because you're going to help me. You're going to help show me how to make him looking down. So teachers, pause the video. And let's let the kids put the faces in, and the last one, have him looking down. Okay, where'd you put those eyeballs? I put them right here to make him looking down. So if you put them down there, then that's awesome. Now, if you didn't, don't worry about it. Because sometimes we learn the best from when we make a little mistake. It's okay. That's how I became an artist, by making tons of mistakes. Oh, look who it is. It's Tex again. We better be quiet. Okay, shh, we gotta be quiet. Okay, so I want all eyes up here again. I'm gonna draw some emotions for you. So I want you to watch, because you're gonna get another chance to draw. So the first one I'm going to draw here, I'm not going to tell you what it is. 
But I want you to raise your hands if you think you know. This is an easy one, huh? Okay. If you raised your hand because you were going to say happy, you were right. All right. Now this next one. Hmm. What's this one going to be? We don't know yet. Oh, the eyes look kind of sleepy. Hmm, maybe it's sleepy. Oh, but with that frown, I'm thinking, yep, you're right. Sad. Okay, now you got to be quiet so everybody can watch and listen. This next one, hmm, big, huge mouth, big teeth, bright eyes. It's got to be excited, huh? Maybe he just had a birthday party and got a really fun present. Okay, what could this one be over here? I didn't draw this one dark enough, so it's going to be a little light. I hope you can see it. But this one, see that big mouth he's yawning? He's tired or sleepy. Yeah, I should have drawn darker there, huh? Okay, now what would this one be right here? Big, huge eyes. Little nose. Ooh, little tiny eye, eye pupils. Ooh, a mouth. Oh, mo yep, he's scared, isn't he? Oh, or frightened. Huh. See that mouth with the teeth open? Yep. And if you do this in a mirror, you can actually make all these faces and see that your face looks pretty close to what these guys look like. That's how I figured it out. What's this guy right here? Yep, he's angry. Okay, but you got to raise your hands. Okay, that's right. Okay, everybody quiet. And, oh, kind of, oh, this guy's a little bored. I think he's just kind of tired and bored. What about this one right here? Okay. Hmm. A big, huge mouth with teeth. This is a crazy kid. Oh, he's crazy mad, crazy angry. He doesn't even have a nose. Okay, so those are emotions. Now, this is your turn to practice. Your teacher will make sure that you have a pencil and paper, and then you guys get to draw some emotions. And let me encourage you that when you get home today, you look in the mirror and make these faces and you'll actually be able to see some of these shapes on your face and you'll be able to figure out how to draw emotions okay time to practice okay on these last ones I want you to look at the paintings that I've done and see if you can tell what kind of emotion each character has so raise your hand if you think you know look at this guy what about these guys? Hmm. Ooh, what about this guy? And that one. Hmm, I wonder how this guy's feeling. This guy's camping. I wonder what he's doing. Hey, this is what does this frog feel like? Well, that's the end of this video. That was a fun lesson. I had a lot of fun. I hope you did too. I love drawing emotions, like I said before. I love it. Okay, so that's the end of video number three. And now we're ready for video number four. Whenever your teacher's ready. It might not be time right now. I'm sorry if it's not. But join me back for video number four. We're gonna have a whole new lesson.